Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am here to do another haul. This is going to be with the Himalaya products. I have talked about it already, but if you're just now catching the deal, it is buy one get one free, earn $10 when you spend 30 with a limit of 4. It is a monthly deal, but the reason for doing it this week is because we have a $5 back on any one Himalaya product up to 5 times on Ibotta. So I'm going to go ahead and pick up four of these. They're at $14.99 here in my store. So that's going to put me just under the 30 So I will have to figure this one out. Let me do the math and see what i got to do to make it work. All right, so on the other aisle, they have these turmeric 95s. So these are the next one up in price for $18.99. Everything else was way too high. So I'm going to go ahead and get one of these and three of the ashwagandha. All right, grabbing these four with the buy one, get one free puts my total at $33.98. I have the five off of 25 to use, but I also have this um, printable Catalina. This just printed off yesterday, so I'm going to go ahead and spend an extra $6.02 so I can use both the 5 off 25 and the 3 off 15. The tags weren't up yesterday, but there's a deal on the Duracell batteries. It's earn $5 when you buy two. It is a monthly deal, and it, there's also another deal on the Optimum batteries. As you can see, I have no stock in my store, but they're $20 back when you buy two on the Optimum. Uh, these other ones here, the 18 count are also included. And just a heads up on the Fiji rebate offer on Ibotta. They're now saying that you have to buy two to get the 75 cents back. So be sure to be careful with that in case you're planning on doing this. Um, it worked for me for buying one, you get 75 cents. And then they limited it to one offer. Um, so yeah, be careful. And here's another monthly deal on the Nivea lip and the EOS lip balm. It's buy one, you get $2 back, a limit of two. The Nivea lip balms that are $3.69 are also included in that, so you can get the cheaper ones instead. Remember, limit two. I'm going to pick up one of the shampoo and conditioners. They're going to get me with the buy one, get me 50% off to $4.43, I think it was. And then I'm going to get $4 back in bonus cash. So making it $0.43 cents for two. These items are great uh, to donate. And actually, they work really well on my dog. I actually prefer using this rather than dog shampoo and conditioner because I can't seem to find one that doesn't make him itch. And this works really well. Here's everything I'm picking up. My total is $40.33. I'll be using the 5 off of 25 and this 3 off of 15. I'll be getting $10 back for the ashwagandha, $3, uh, $4 back for the suave. Nothing back here. These were just clearance items. $1.37 for the undercover snacks and $0.50 cents for the trash bags. Those are on clearance. And I will be getting a total of $20 back from Ibotta for the ashwagandha, or the Himalaya products, I should say. So in the end, it'll make this a $1.66 moneymaker, so not too bad. I'm going to go ahead and check out and let you know how it all turns out. Here's an overview of my receipt. So that 3 off of 15, the barcode was printed kind of weird so she had to manually enter it in because it wouldn't scan but other than that everything else worked out just as planned my total was $32.33 plus my tax and then I got $14 back and submitting to Ibotta will give me the $20 back making this $34 back on that and then also 403 points so that's equivalent to about 80 something cents around there um, I'll have to figure out the math on that. I'll just times that by 0 .002 and that's what that is worth. And down here, it shows I have $3.97 of tracking if I wanted to do that again. So if it resets, that, that's something I can consider doing. But yeah, guys, in the end, all of that turned out to be a nice 
little freebie plus money maker the money maker takes care of my tax so that was that transaction and they're printing off the little let's see where to go just print it off again so I'm gonna buy a couple more things like a really cheap clearance item so I can see if I can get more of these to print since we don't have a 5 off of 25, we're going to be relying on these pretty heavily. So, yeah, I'll go ahead and see if I can get some more to print. And look what I found. I saw this when I was editing my video yesterday, and I was like, oh my gosh, I didn't even notice that those were there. So I came back and I said, let me pick these up while I can. So I'm going to grab a few of them. They don't expire until July 30th. It's a dollar off of any of these deodorants. So let's put our brains together. What would be the best way to use these dollar off coupons with this deal? Drop it down in the comments. Let's see what we can come up with. I'm going to pick these up. They're on clearance. They're regularly $1.99. So I'll pay 49 cents to test out the Catalina to see if we can get anything to print. I'll do two separate transactions. These will be good to donate or even to have on hand for next year. Shout out to Coupons Are Sweet. She pointed out that these Clairols are in the clearance section. These two are in my clearance section. I'm not sure how much they're ringing up, but I know with the six off the two coupon on coupons.com, it's gonna give some overage. So have that printable ready and purchase these check her out on Instagram if you're not already following her she's amazing she shares awesome deals so I won't be able to pick this up I don't have the coupon I would have to print it tomorrow and then come back to get these if they're still here here's another monthly deal over in the seasonal section on these um, jelly belly 30 flavors jelly beans a dollar back when you buy two with a limit of two all right, and I got these to print. So about four out of the six times it worked. And I didn't mention in the store, but I went back and got some clearance items for the other um, attempts to get Catalinas. These were 72 cents each, and this was 92 cents. Alright guys, and here's a few screenshots of some more monthly deals that I'll be adding to the list, so that should be up in no time. And as far as the bonus cash challenges, I still do not have the money earned from the last two months, so hopefully we see that soon. Red Aid has been late. This is the second, third time that they've been late. They're supposed to have it in by the fifth, so hopefully we'll see something soon. Alright guys, I hope this video was helpful. If it was, please give it a thumbs up, and I'll catch you on the next one.